If you find yourself reading this book, then you may be sensing something stirring out there in human culture, a tweaking of the senses, an opening to life's mystery. Many commentators have called it an emerging new worldview or a period of uncertainty and searching in human affairs. But I believe what we're intuiting goes much deeper than any of these labels. It goes to the heart of how we think about the history of the cosmos and of who we are as human beings. It is nothing less than the discovery of another way of pursuing life that is decidedly spiritual, but yet is not anti-science or anti-evolution, or dependent on any one religious tradition for that matter. It entails a shift in our direct, everyday experience of the transcendent, as experience quite apart from whatever tradition we come from. The Celestine Prophecy is a spiritual adventure novel that combines fiction with profound insights into the nature of reality and personal growth. The book is divided into nine insights, which are essentially spiritual revelations that the main character experiences as he embarks on a journey in search of an ancient manuscript containing a series of insights that promise to transform humanity. What is occurring now is more of an awakening, a natural filling out of our innate potential the unused parts of our brain, the rest of our DNA that's been waiting to fire off. All happening quite spontaneously as a natural consequence of every discovery and human searching that has taken place in the eons that have come before us. Our aha today falls in the same line of discovery that began with the jolting observation, long ago, that our tribal mates were actually dying, which meant we were going to die as well, which first lifted us out of our primeval sleep. Our ability to stay awake expanded even more when we unleashed our reflective power on the sides of caves, initiating the first artistic reflection on our world. And this awareness began to be instituted fully, with the sense of courageous objectivity we achieved when we finally invented science. All these steps perked us up a bit more to the real human condition that we most want to repress, the fact that we find ourselves here in life with no real certainty as to why. It's this more awakened state that fuels the current exploration of spiritual consciousness. We are asking the same age-old questions. Why are we here? Where are we going? How are my actions part of all this? The only difference is that now there are more of us asking, and the answers are finally arriving. Greatest of all is that because of all the searching before us, these answers are less abstract, more connected to our real lives. We can prove them to ourselves, we're here to experience and become part of what I think of as a mystical evolutionary flow that will finish the whole evolution of the cosmos, of life, and of human culture in a way that was always inevitable. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to stop and leave the details to the reading of the book. Insight 1. The Notion of Synchronicity the first insight focuses on synchronicity, the idea that meaningful coincidences are not random, but are a part of a larger, interconnected pattern of the universe. Recognizing these synchronicities can lead to a more fulfilling life. In our journey, we encounter countless synchronicities, like pieces of a cosmic puzzle falling into place. These moments remind us that we're on the right path. Insight 2. The Energy of Others the second insight introduces the concept of energy exchanges between individuals. It encourages us to be aware of the energetic dynamics in our interactions with others and how they affect our well-being. As we tune into the energy of others, we unlock the potential for more meaningful connections and a heightened sense of unity with the people we meet. Insight 3. Clearing Past Traumas this insight deals with the importance of healing past traumas and negative experiences to free up our energy and live in the present moment. Healing our past wounds allows us to release the heavy baggage that has held us back, making room for the light of our true selves to shine through. Insight 4. The Power of Prayer and Intention the fourth insight emphasizes the power of prayer and intention, suggesting that when we direct our thoughts and energy towards positive outcomes, we can manifest them more effectively. Prayer and intention are our tools to shape the world we desire. With focused intent, we become co-creators of our reality. Insight 5. 
The Flow of Energy in Relationships. Here, the book explores how we can learn to identify and transcend control dramas in our relationships, thereby creating healthier, more harmonious connections with others. Understanding and transcending control dramas in our relationships empowers us to create spaces of love, compassion, and true understanding. Insight 6. The Quest for Truth. The sixth insight encourages us to question our societal belief systems and discover our personal truths, which can lead to greater self-awareness and spiritual growth. The quest for personal truth liberates us from societal constraints, guiding us toward a life that resonates with our inner wisdom. Insight 7. The Awakening of the Global Consciousness This insight suggests that as individuals awaken to higher spiritual consciousness, they contribute to a global awakening that will ultimately transform the world. As we awaken individually, we contribute to the global awakening, a shift in collective consciousness that's transforming the world. Insight 8. The Interconnectedness of All Life The eighth insight focuses on the interconnectedness of all life forms and the realization that we are part of a grander, universal design. We're not just part of the universe. We are the universe. Realizing our interconnectedness brings forth an appreciation for the grand tapestry of existence. Insight 9. The Evolution of Humanity The final insight brings everything full circle, emphasizing the role of each individual in contributing to the evolution of humanity through love, understanding, and spiritual awakening. Our love, compassion, and awakened consciousness hold the keys to humanity's evolution. Together, we propel the world toward a brighter future. The Celestine Prophecy is a captivating blend of adventure and metaphysical wisdom. Through the main character's journey, readers are invited to explore the profound insights, prompting us to question our understanding of reality and our role in the universe. I highly recommend reading the book to experience the full impact of these insights and how they can apply to your life. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Metaphysics in Minutes for more quick and insightful book summaries from the world of metaphysics. Thanks for joining us today.